This is Steve, and this clip we're going to interview the founder, CEO, co-founder, and a lot of the staff of a fascinating company where Steve Wozniak is chief scientist. Here. So, right. Okay, this is Steve Bell from Network World Interrog, the startup city. Fusion I.O. has a very exciting booth, as we've showed you. A wall, a video. How many feet wide is this thing? 40 inch LCDs by four wide and four high. We've been visiting with the CEO, Mr. David Bradford. Yes. David is a former Novell executive, uh, worked for Ray for Ray Norda for Ray 10 years and Eric Schmidt for four. That's Great. So you've been telling me about the company and its prospects and have introduced me to. Uh, Rick White. Rick. Yeah. And you're the co-founder of the company. You know, I am one of those, but uh, these days I'm just the marketing guy. Oh, chief marketing geek, huh? Yeah, okay. yeah. I get to hide in the back room. It's not a bad they, gig. They, 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 this they thing hide up. me. I'm like the Quasimodo <laughs> of the company. Hook you up solid with meetings in the booth. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great I fun. sit on top of the building and scream. I'm you sure know, it's your favorite bells. job ever. <laughs> <laughs> and, and Rick has ADD, Does so he? he created this unbelievable demonstration. This is what he uses at home to watch TV shows. I yeah, see. look at that. No, that's no. Look, you watch all channels. Bottom on line, Comcast. I'm paying for the 500 cable channels. Huh? I'm gonna watch them. Not bad. All right, all Not at the bad. same time, right? Actually, <laughs> we're know, doing over a thousand. No, over a over thousand, thousand on this one wall. videos. That is just and, something else. Talk about and, it. And something else. Here. Yeah. Those are not just little small, those are full quality DVDs. Here, I'll blow one up for you down here. Okay, we're going to go to this screen. Look at that, 40 inch They're actually uh, full quality. I think there's a market for this in Silicon Valley in the uh, McMansions. Uh, Doing, everyone would have to have a bigger one in their uh, video room. You know, Steve you know, Wozniak the would be one there. of those. There you go. You know, we I wouldn't actually... be surprised. You know, he lives six blocks from me. I'll have to ask him. The Woz? Yeah. Ask him yeah. about what company he works for right now. Okay. Because he do would that. say Fusion I.O. Oh, I he's think I've heard about scientist. that. No kidding. I heard about you guys hiring him. Yeah, that was yeah, he's our chief scientist. And you know, it's crazy. Everyone says, oh, oh did you just bring him in because of Buzz? And it's like, no, he works with Flynn. And he really likes to get down into the technology and oh, work with yeah. the engineers. And the value. The guy is just absolutely brilliant. He brings I, so I, much value. I'll tell you how much, how much I like to listen to him. I even watch Kathy Gifford's Life on the D-List to, to hear from him. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. He, is he so didn't funny. marry Kathy. He's married to a yeah. wonderful woman. But yes, Kathy. great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. By the by the way, you uh, brought this up as far as a museum. We actually yeah. had the Museum of Modern Art uh, suggest that we put this on display. You should. Yeah. yeah this, this is actual display. I mean, I've seen people with circus wheels and guys on bikes riding in a circle at this show to try to get attention. This blows away anything ever done. Yeah, you know those people that one. have to do those bikes in circles or yeah, mechanical bulls. Exactly. Uh, I mean, those people look like that's well, one they look like us. <laughs> yeah, we did that too. Yeah, we did the video wall back in 010. That's right. <laughs> We're getting better. Okay, now a serious question. Tell us about this company. Uh, we looked at the hardware in another piece with your your guys, your marketing people. I saw a, a storage device that is no moving parts, um, flash memory, I guess. 64 gigabytes, I believe. Tell us the mission of the company. Uh, boil it down for us in a minute or two elevator speech about what you're doing that's disruptive. Sure. So, uh, in 60 seconds. Well, you, you today, can have five minutes if you want. But today, companies, today companies aggregate lots of RAM in a server, right. or they aggregate lots of disk drives right. uh, to, to make up for the fact that I.O. is slow. Right. And the reason I.O. is slow is just like a record player, disk drives spin and the needle has to find the You're data. Waiting for a servo yeah, it has to, to move the head. It's ratcheting it has to the head into it. position. <laughs> so what do you do? So, as, 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 in 1987, that's the point in, the, in, in 1987, a single uh, drive could keep a CPU 80, 90 percent CPU utilization. Right, right. right? By 97, it took 25 drives. Why? Well, the processors are following Moore's law. Yeah. But the drives are not. have to move ahead, so they're bound by the laws of physics they're not or new Newtonian dynamics, right? Yeah, exactly. Mass. 2007, uh -huh. right? It takes 600 drives. No kidding. Today, with multi core, a it's over 1,000 drives. So uh -huh. you have to say to yourself, we're talking about virtualization, we're talking about multi-core now, is processors. That, is that a fundamental true for a SAN network with a, a big drive array, or is that in a Exactly, yeah. A Still SAN is. would be a good example. Okay. The other thing is, these SANs burn a lot of power, yeah. about half the power in your Fiber data channels, center. Fiber power hungry. Right? Yep. Yep. And uh, they're very expensive to maintain. Yep. 
And it's, well, Giggy's moving in on them. Right. So. We actually see companies that will have a full uh, rack of discs uh -huh. next to two servers. Huh. Okay. And the discs are trying to keep up with the server. Yeah, because it takes that many disk drives to keep up. Oh, with that many.